I'm gonna demonstrate how to do side overs on the short box on the reformer. I've got all the springs on. I'm seated on the box and facing the foot bar to start. I'm gonna put my right ankle in the safety strap. So ankle right on the top of the foot just to make sure it's nice and secure. And then I'm gonna pivot to my left. I'm gonna take that right leg and I'm gonna bring it a little bit forward. I wanna make sure all my joints are in the same line pointing to the left. Shoulders stacked over hips, rotate from the hips. So my right sit bone might lift a little bit here. I find my side plank. So I reach the fingertips long, take an inhale, then I exhale into the side bend, right? So lifting that right foot into the safety strap, I'm gonna lower, try to touch the floor with my left fingertips, and then I'm gonna lift from my right side of my waistline. Inhale, lower, and exhale to lift. My leg, my pelvis, stays perfectly still and I'm keeping tension in that strap. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. So if this bothers someone's shoulders to have their arms reaching that far away, you can always do hands behind the head or arms across the chest or hands to the hips. So try to keep the head in line with the spine and then we can add on from here. So you can find an isometric hold. Let me go back out to the T, I like that the best. Lower and hold. So just that isometric work through your core. You can add rotations. So you twist from behind the belly button. You can add little pulses. Lower, lift, lower, lift, lower, lift. Twist back to center. And then you come up, right? You can do a little counter stretch towards the bar. And then you can do a full mermaid stretch towards the post and the pulleys. And from here, you also have the option of adding rotation. Hands go to the headrest. You can come all the way back through. And that was side overs on the reformer.